Hello everyone, today we are going to be talking about the best pen organizers that I have, in my opinion, so I will share those with you because I always get asked about them, so I figured I'd make a video for you guys to share what I use to organize my pen. So first off, it's okay if you are a pen hoarder and pen collector like myself, but I know that sometimes they can just get thrown all over the place and let's face it we've all been there before and it's easy to get caught up when you are working and you just throw them all over your desk and then I will say I did used to be that person that just moved all my pens from place to place and they never really had like a home so I can finally say that I got it together and organized my life and I'm not gonna lie it has made things so much easier now that everything has a home so that's just a little fyi don't worry if your pens are not organized like this so first we are going to talk about these plain old cups and really you can use any kind of cups but I got these from Amazon and I really like these because, well, first of all, they fit in my dream box and I know I'm going to get a lot of questions, but the storage, can, the huge storage box that you see is called a dream box and I will leave a link below for that. But anyways, back to the cups. They are a perfect rounded square shape so they fit together in the dream box and they also hold a ton of pens. So these are good for pens that can be stored vertically. Next up we have the Tool Cubby from the Create Room Company who is the company who makes the Dream Box. And these Tool Cubbies hold a ton of pens and it's perfect because they can be stored horizontally. And then you can also store the whole entire Tool Cubby horizontally or vertically. So I actually have four of them and I store them both horizontally and vertically. And then next up we have the Crafters Companion Pen Trays which I got on Amazon and I will leave links for all these so that you guys can see them for yourselves and it comes with six trays in a set and these ones have separate compartments to store each individual pen which makes it really easy to find and it makes it easy to take them out and replace and then this is also great for pens that need to be stored horizontally it takes up a little bit more space and fits less pens but it looks really nice to display pens so there's some give and take on that Next up we have the US Art Supply pen holders and these are just plastic and they're great for storing pens vertically. They're very inexpensive and they hold a ton of pens and it's nothing really fancy but it definitely just gets the job done. I use them for my Karen markers. I have a couple different sets of Karen markers and they need to be stored vertically. So. This is perfect for it. I do use some glue to glue them together because they do come apart fairly easily, which can be frustrating. So, um, but other than that, it's a really cheap and expensive option. Before I had my dream box, I used to use these acrylic storage organizers, which are mainly used for like makeup and stuff like that, but I use them for pens and they would work really well as long as the pens weren't too long. And then next up we have the Organize More pen holder. So this pen holder holds a substantial amount of pens and I still consider this to be stored horizontally even though the compartments are at just a very slight angle. It allows your pens to be seen very easily and it keeps them super organized. So this organizer has five compartments and can be partnered with other ones as well to create just a huge pen organizing system. 
And then one of the last ways that you can store your pens is just in the original containers. Some people don't like to or some people love to keep them in the original containers. I don't like certain packaging like um, like Tombow packaging. I won't keep my pens in those packages. But like for Karen markers, they make these really nice looking display boxes. So I actually fold my box back so that I can put them on display. For the most part though, I will not keep my pens in the original packaging just because I feel like I like to have everything in rainbow order. So sometimes when you have multiple sets of something, I just like to take them all out so that I can see all the different colors. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you have any questions down below. I'm going to leave links for everything for you guys so that you can see where I got them from. And let me know if you have a favorite pen organizer or something that works for you because I'm always looking for different options. But currently I love my situation right now, but I do constantly get new pens. So it's always good to keep an eye open for different ways to organize them.